All right, guys, welcome to another episode of Rob's Metals. And today, I have a special episode for you. Yeah. Um, yes. Yeah, turn down the volume a bit. Um, it's got some coins from overseas and um, and from local means as well. Yeah. And yeah, let's let's get into it. So the first kind I want to look at um, is the recently released. 2021 Quokka from Perth Mint. Yeah, just got it this week. Um, all the dealers have it. The reason I got it was because I wanted to have a Quokka coin for the kids. I missed out on last year's one. As it was just like a chipmunk and I didn't think like it was worth buying. The lack of detail and last year's coins from Perth Mint was really, really, like not really good. Most of the coins. But this one is nice, got the mum and baby quokka, it's got the butterflies, got the mint pea mark. Um, it's got the um, nice native um, flower plants, it's blue tongue lizard. Yeah, it looks like the natural environment of the quokkas. So all in all, tells a story, two happy quokkas yeah, on Rockless Island. So yeah, definitely a coin worth um, to keep a couple for the kids. Yeah, next up, yeah, once I was when I was ordering the bars, ordering the bars, um, the dealer had one of these um, in stock. Um, this is really hard to find, right? This is another hard to find coin because it's uh, issued by the, um, it's commissioned by EMK uh, in Europe. It's like LPM. It's one of the bigger dealers there, and yeah, their coins don't come cheap. Um, this one is the Black Pearl Pirates of the Caribbean 2021 coin. Yeah, I just had to order it because it had that, you know, the pirate ship. Um, it's got Jack Sparrow and yeah, if you like the film, you like the coin, yeah? Just like the Mandalorian and the, all the Mandalorian coins. Yeah, and of course they like to put the new um, country thing behind, the New Zealand Mint, so that they can call it legal tender and Give it a bit of numismatic value but yeah i just had to get this one to add it to my oops add it to my um pirate pirate coin collection so look, yeah. there we go all right so if you um if you ever need some pirate coins these are the ones to go for a bit expensive but nice addition to the stack and um, finally, last but not least, let's get to the Beskabas. So these were really hard to get hold of. Um, they basically just sold out in a couple hours on release everywhere. And I think it was released to American dealers mainly. Um, and yeah, got, we have legions of Star Wars fans all over the world. So yeah, everyone is just ordering and buying it up. Yeah. Um, it's quite a small bar and the reason why I have the capsule is just to demonstrate these are the um, capsules for the usually we put the, the Perth Mint um, rectangular bars and coins oh, these are the air, these are airtight capsules and yeah they, they decided I, I think they don't want us to put this in the capsule so they actually made it extra long like the Beskar bars in the movie and yeah it just doesn't fit so you might have to Get a capsule from one of those Chinese makers that make them extra big and extra long in order to fit the pesto bar. See, it just doesn't fit. It's just over 50 centimeters. So anyways, um, yeah, and the other thing is, um, it's got a bit of marking there from the, I think it's from the machine in the, the maybe the sorting machines or something in the mint or the press but um yeah it gives it a bit of a rough look but i think overall nice bar it's got the reeded edge see it looks like the Beskar bar from the movie doesn't it and behind it they they didn't put the queen's head they opted for the crest so it's still legal tender it's got uh newy newy on it um, there's got the public seal of Nui, yeah, so it's two dollars and 
one try ounce 999 fine silver so it's still I think legal tender yeah, but, yeah. it's nice bar very cool bar so yeah those of you who pre-ordered I've already sent it out yesterday afternoon once I got the coins so you'll probably be getting your coins sometimes next week yeah um, yeah so hope you enjoyed this episode yeah, I had to film it quite a few times, but I hope you enjoyed this episode. And um, remember to click click down here to subscribe. Yeah, and maybe check out a couple of my other videos if you haven't. And yeah, remember to give the thumbs up to like this video as well. Yeah, and I'll answer to any comments you may have. And if you want to get your hands on one of these or one of the other coins in my videos, please um, just check the links out below. And send me a message, yeah? yeah? Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.